George was a fantasist who had falsely claimed to be named Paul Gadd, real name of Gary Glitter or Barry Bulsara, the cousin of Queen singer Freddie Mercury. When police eventually searched his flat, they found dozens of photographs of local women. George, who once worked as a messenger at the BBC, also had four copies of the Jill Dando memorial issue of the corporation's in-house magazine, Ariel. Infamously, they recovered this photograph of George posing in a gas mask while holding a starting pistol. Detectives were convinced they had their man when a forensic scientist said he'd found a particle of what could have been firearms residue from the gun used to kill Jill Dando. At his trial, George's only alibi was that he couldn't have murdered Jill because he was stalking another woman elsewhere in Fulham. On July 2, 2001, George was found guilty by a 10 to 1 majority jury verdict and sentenced to life in prison. But doubts remained over his ability to carry out such a 